What's up, everybody? Welcome back to more Lives of P. I've got myself a new headset, microphone, and I'm ready to rumble. So let's continue on, shall we? Uh, we're going to give those to release that guy a second. See if we can get a couple backstabs here. Oh, nope. Oh, wasn't what I wanted to do, but it was effective nonetheless. Oh, oh, ho, ho. not getting any backstabs. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Come on in. Oh, oh, that's not good. That's not good. Stupid dog. Why are you over here? What the heck? All right, this is a bad start. All right. Still can't get the backstab. See, I told you it's pretty finicky. <clears throat> All right. Okay. Wasted a little bit of health there. Not too, not too happy about that, but it's fine. We'll reset in just a second. Do want to clear out this area though? Come on then. Bring you down here. Oh, completely with that. But we got the backstab, so. Been trying to do. Um, bring around the Rosie, huh? There we go. That's more like it. Let's run over here quickly. This vivid egg of fragment. Open this little shortcut here so we don't have to run through those guys again. Wasting our health. The slowest opening door in the West. Little donkey man. Uh, since recording the last episode, or since recording this episode, uh, I am on the last chapter of the game on my other playthrough so I know roundabouts what to do what not to do um, that was a big whiff on you sir just got a couple thwaps here oh just getting wrecked I should have guarded but I didn't all right come on then try to hit me oh successfully hit me Getting stuck on these bodies. Ooh, good block. Oh, what? What is this? There we go. I sent off my charge attack while he was in the air and it just did not connect. Alright, he's dead. As you can see, you can take quite a few hits there. No survivors here. We sure do. If you don't remember, there was a lady that wanted us to find her child. There is no child. Will you be my friend? Everyone is gone. I'm all alone now. I would have been if I knew who you were. Right, we're gonna... There we go. Getting a little bit better about that. Come on then. Oh, okay. You just completely whiffed. Just gonna go ahead and heal because it doesn't really matter at this point. We'll be coming right back here in just a little bit. Let's open this chest. Puppet Destroyer's Amulet. We are going to throw that on for sure. Does extra damage against puppets. And then we need to assess what we want to do here in just a little while. Um, there's really not a whole, whole lot we can do. I'm going to throw this on though. This and this. 
Um, basically, this gives you enhanced. Uh, I cannot think of the word. Let you. Uh, good lord! I'll just read the freaking item description. In templar temporarily increases attribute resistances. I was gonna say enhance resistance to effects like shock and other stuff that you'll see later on. I didn't even acknowledge this. Ooh. Foreshadowing. Ooh. Alright, we're gonna go back to that lady and give her her uh, a baby. We're gonna give her a baby. We're actually right here, so I'm just gonna rest. I just run across this bridge because it's pointless to do to teleport to that stargazer up there and take the elevator down. I mean, she's right over here. So. It's probably just as quick, if not quicker, for me to just run over there. Of course, we got three enemies we got to deal with here. One's inside. One's here. They're just both gonna come at me, huh? Well, I didn't, and I'm not gonna block apparently. Woo! Well, that was actually better than I thought it would be. This dog's gonna take forever to get up, so we'll just mess it up. And some enemies that you fight do not come back, thankfully. So I don't know what that is. I don't know if you just saw it, but sometimes in this game, when you run, your character just see he just freaks. I don't know what it is. I mean, it's obviously a glitch. It's not like world-ending, but you found her, Guide One. I could sense her from miles away. Oh, my sweet Elena. Mm-hmm. Please let me hold her. All yours. There, there, my baby. I've missed you so much. <laughs> what do you think? Is my baby adorable? We're just gonna be nice and say that she's a cute baby. That's right, kind one. You've granted me my only wish. My sweet Elena. We're going to be happy now. Thank you so much, kind one. Please accept my heartfelt gratitude. She just gave us a record, our first one, that we can play on the gramophone at the hotel. And the records are actually really good. I don't know if you get copyright right strikes for playing them in the game. I would really hope not, but never know. And we also got, yeah, a vivid ergo fragment. We have enough to level up again, so we're going to do that. Before we make our way to the end of this chapter. Because if you didn't already guess, we stopped right before that boss. See, look at that. I don't know what it is. It's twitchy. Like, I literally... My character flings to the left on its own. It doesn't happen throughout the whole game. It's just certain spots. So weird. Uh, how much do we need to level up? 1,500. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pop these. Should... I don't think that... That might be enough to level up twice. We're going to go to Hotel Crot. Level up come back and take on the boss of this area, the big bad. Hopefully it goes well. Cross our fingers. The puppet 
the, or the parade master fight didn't go that well for me, so... I was going to take a chance and play that track while we're here. It is what it is. It's a really good track. It's my favorite. I'll use my power to help you. Doesn't really fit with the theme. <laughs> but it's still a good song. I'm going to bump this up to you. Dance with me. Do I have anything? That's pretty much the song. It's a really good song. Uh, where? Okay, yes, here. Let's go on now. And fight the corrupt watchman, I think is the name of the next boss. Something like that. So we can completely avoid those enemies there, and if we're extra sneaky, we don't have to fight either of these either. If he turns around, okay. Ooh. Got it. We also don't have to fight him. I will be taking these guys out though. Just Ooh. Oh. Nope. Was hoping not to fight you both at once, but there we go. Oh, and broke his weapon. All right. So we didn't take any damage. That's great. Pump this up here, turn Jiminy back on. I don't know why he was off. Alright. And this is a mechanic of the game. I don't understand why people don't use things that are intended in games like this. Uh, you cannot call, like, other actual players in this game. You can only call on NPCs to help you fight in certain bosses. Um, and the game actually, see, I already had 12 star fragments. I think in my playthrough I have like 50. So it's obviously intended to be used because you get a lot of these star fragments. If you want to go in there and just try to do it on your own, by all means, go ahead. But there's stuff later on that, I mean, there's actual items that are used with these specters. So kind of like Elden Ring, if you've played that with the... Uh, summons just 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 do this just call on an npc to help you because it's going to make your life 10 times easier or at least a little easier not 10 times uh okay so drink this head inside
Graft Watchman. Okay. That is his name. Ooh! See, we got our Spectre in there. I'm completely with that. I'm not trying to go over there and get whiffed. Well, not good. Not the best start ever. But we're doing work. See, the Spectre's taking a lot of the hits right now. Which is nice. Whew. Now he's going for me. I try to stay but oop. Try to stay behind this guy as much as possible. He's obviously got electricity all over him, so none of the electric stuff that we've been getting beforehand is going to do anything to him. Got him staggered. He's almost dead. We've got three health left. Oh, and he grabs me. For some decent damage. Spectre might take him out. Alright. He did. Not too bad at all. We got a bunch of stuff here. Our Spectre friend's gonna leave. Repair the Stargazer. Alright. And then we're gonna run over here and grab an important item. Faded Whistle. Friends. So if you recall, there was an NPC in another window that we talked to that said, The Watchman was my friend. If you can infer that we just fought the Watchman, he's no longer a friendly man. Puppet. Thing. Uh, but we did find some things that might give her a little bit, or him, I don't really know, a little bit of, uh, solace. Trying to see what all we got. Okay, we got his ergo, we got two quartz, which will be useful later. Storage battery, that will be useful later. Got the P-Organ core heart. And we got the small wooden officer puppet and the faded whistle, so we're doing pretty good. I think there's like an item right in here on the left. I could be wrong. Oh, it's right here. Dear citizens of Krat, the factory has been occupied by the puppets. Whatever the cause, Vanini Company is responsible for it. I, Lorenzi Vanini, am going along to stop those devils. The factory is very dangerous now. Stay out of it and keep safe. The rest I'll leave to Mr. Geppetto, whom I trust more than anyone. God save us all. Regards, Lorenzini Vanini. So that is where we are headed next, is the Vanini factory. But first we have some people to talk to. One of them being Geppetto, and we have some very nice items to help us along on our journey. I'm just glad that we got through that fight pretty easily. I mean, you can most certainly take on every boss without a specter, but I don't know why you would. Like, there's no achievement for it other than saying that you did it. I mean, congrats, I guess. I don't... <laughs> just doesn't make sense to me. But Obtain ergo... Let me make sure... Yeah, this isn't one that I need. Don't believe. So we're gonna pop that. We're gonna give ourselves some good levels here. Saved Geppetto. Wonderful. Yep, sure did. He is on the second floor. He can hardly wait to see you. Yay! I'll good old Jep. Power to help you. Cool, because I want to level up. Uh, we're just gonna keep... Dumping points into motivity. Vitality and vigor doesn't really need it right now. Strength trumps all in this game. You got there. Come here for a sec, would you? I yep. picked up traces of high powered energy originating far away. That's one mystery solved. Why don't we make a legion arm with it? 
Mr. Vanini is the expert when it comes to legion arms, but I'm pretty sure I can make one. The puppets get fried easily by electricity. If you use an electric legion arm, it'll make your life easier. We got a new legion arm. We're definitely going to put it on because it's pretty darn useful for now. More useful than one, the other ones we have for sure. Do you have anything else to say? To factory to save Mr. Vini, right? He's the richest man in Krat. A little eccentric, maybe, but a good person. I heard he went to shut the factory down. Hmm. I hope he's safe. I wouldn't want to lose my best customer. I know my way around a weapon. Okay, that's all she had to say. Uh... Yeah, I don't need... I, know my I mean, I'm gonna quickly exhaust her dialogue. A stargazer. I, I don't know my way around. need to know any of this. If you want Neither do you. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Mr. He's... I heard he went... Okay. Now... We can assemble weapons here. We can alter handles here. That'll come into effect later. Uh, see if we can upgrade this weapon again. Nope, I'm missing one moonstone. Do you have a moonstone for sale? I don't think you do just yet. Nope, we can talk to you. Yeah, 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 uh, is there something over here I can read yet? Yes, there is. That book reminds me. Have you ever heard the fairy tale about a mischievous wooden puppet? All of Krat knows the story. All because of someone who loved that story more than anyone else. Ah, but this is strange. I, I do not recall who exactly was that someone. I wonder what the story could be about, huh? <laughs> Maybe it's called Pinocchio. Let's go run up to Geppetto. There's no quick way to him, but there is a quick way down, which is nice. Jeppy, my boy! Ah, uh, you've returned. Forgive a sentimental father for worrying about his son. Always remember that you're precious to me. Even when I ask you to do something dangerous. Speaking of I'm just wearing there's a factory a donkey head. Boulevard. It's packed with countless puppets. My friend, the inventor Vinini, went to stop him, but he never came back. Please, go save him, and shut down the factory. P organs are the source of your powers. Collect quartz to get the strength you need. Remember, the hotel is the last safe place in Krat. It's our only refuge in a city full of perils. It'll be extremely dangerous if anyone has ill intentions. Be careful who you tell about this place, especially if they're stalkers or alchemists. Be wary of dangerous people. And always be a good boy to me. Alright, P organs, yada yada. This is basically our skill tree. Uh, you want to be very particular in how you go about this because quartz isn't really easy to come by. So you. I hate the way it navigates though. Alright, we want this. This gives us a second dodge. This is what we want first of all. Uh, let's see. Enhances fatal attack. 
Increases stagger duration. Paints Fable Arts attack. Enhance Fatal Attack Pulse Cell Charge. Lower damage while dodging. I don't want that. Hmm. I don't think I ever increase ergo upon eliminating an enemy. Yeah, we'll put that on. And we have one more quartz, so we will increase... We'll enhance the fatal... Actually, no. We'll increase staggered duration so that we have longer to attack an enemy when they're in that staggered position. Sometimes it is not easy to get you back to them to do anything. Thank you. Benini gave me that key. And now he's missing. Rescue him if you can. A sure thing. Of Krod. It's probably not how you remember it, eh? Ask me any questions, and I'll fill in the gaps. Uh. We'll learn Benini about these things as we Benini get through them. The so, again, I'm just going to be exhausting all dialogue. Rosa, I believe, is special. If you're super interested, uh, I suppose you could pause and read those. But, uh, I'm not worried about that right now. We're going to take these off. Don't need that anymore. I don't want this. Never use it. Uh, okay. Let's move along. We need to do this real quick before I forget. <laughs> Just gonna run past everything. Get on out of here. Should be able to slide down here. Is that an issue? This dude shouldn't be here anymore. Okay. Shouldn't be beat, or shouldn't be pursued. If only we could play together like we used to. Murphy. I Murphy. Miss you. So, this isn't obvious, but I fiddled around because I was like, obviously there's something with the items we picked up, right? So, if you select this, you can actually use it. Hey, that sound. Is that you, Murphy? I know that whistle. It must be Murphy. <sighs> Thanks for coming by. I want to play, but... I feel too sick. I, I don't think I can. I miss Zack and Sophie and Eric. <sighs> I wish we could all play. <sighs> So, um, you can no longer talk to this NPC, so I believe it's inferred that they died. Uh, Sophie, Eric, and the other one also obviously died. So we gave that NPC a little peace of mind, even though it was technically a lie. They at least like, got to die with some happiness, so. A little bit of a silver lining there. I actually... No, let's go back. We Okay. See what I mean? He's quick on the draw. He's accurate to boot. 
I'll rest real quick before he can shoot us again. Okay. We'll head. We'll actually teleport this time between these stargazers because I don't want to fight all that crap. To get back to where we were. On ahead. Forge ahead. Go, go, go. I'm going to try my very best to get to the next stargazer before this ends, but Here no guarantees. Everything you see here belongs to Vanini, the classiest playboy and most brilliant in the plot. Just ask him. Not just puppets. Almost every machine and tram and crod is supplied from here. You gotta be curious about the guy. What kind of person is he? Uh, I wish we could find him. That is, if he's still kicking. All right. So, yeah, I forgot about you, weirdo. Take you out. Um, so there is the factory we're headed to. This game is absolutely gorgeous. Like all the details and everything, they did a very good job. Uh, this is a trap. I don't know if we can set it off without actually falling off, so we're not going to do that. Don't fall for the trap. Uh, then we should have... Yeah. This is what makes it a trap, because you fall down, that guy's there waiting to hit you. And if you're not careful, big man over here is waiting to hit you too. Try not to get his attention. Actually, I think he just saw me. Did you really just see me? Okay, I was about to be ticked off. Alright, we got three dudes over here trying to attack us now, so I'm gonna back up. Go back up top here. Reassess the situation. Oh, that's the trap. I fell for it. Haha, <laughs> great. Well, we can get back up with this ladder. Alright, we got this chick here. Jump back over and attack her, maybe? Got her. Big jump. Nope, don't get pinned in the corner. Died that way so many times. Oh, oh. Alright. Take Mr. Man out. Heal up. Alright. That could have gone a little bit smoother, but it's fine. Uh, I'll drop down here and get this item. Right back around here. I do believe I've gotten everything so far. Drop down. Attack this guy? Maybe? Good. Watch out for these jerks. They've got the accuracy of a god. They will hit you. I'm gonna try to draw him over here. 
make him move towards me. Come on, dude. So that I don't attract the attention of every single one of them at once. That's the last thing I want to do. I got him, and there's another one here. He's not a th throwing fiend, though. And I think we've got it. And here's something that you're going to want to do if you want the platinum, or if you're really worried about it, or if you want some really cool items. Another fine day in the city of Krog, but I wonder, my friend, just where you've been? Oh. <laughs> Congratulations! You've been selected from this cast of... a little... for an exclusive, obtrusive, intrusive... The answer is human. Correct! Fantastic insights, caller. But not everything has to rhyme, you know. I'm not a caricature, I'm the king of riddles. That said, how do we know you didn't just get lucky? Even a stop clock is right twice a day, and even a puppet can be accidentally correct just by random chance. <laughs> is a promise. Arlecchino, tell him what he'll get. Thanks, Arlecchino. Caller, your correct answer has earned you a trinity key. Doors and keys, and keys and doors, the subjects of puzzles and riddles galore. My next riddle won't be so simple to crack. Arlecchino is the king. <laughs> Not some riddling cheap jack. <laughs> Alright, so we got our first Trinity key. There are five, I believe, in total. Uh, so that's the first one. And I actually... I tried to pause. Well, you can't pause in this game, obviously. So I tried to go out of my game on my PS5 to give me a second to think about it, because I was like, I don't like freaking quick pressure. And uh, I didn't pick an answer. I was hovering over human, I believe, but I did not pick an answer. I think it just timed out. So I don't know if you don't answer at all, I think you get the key anyway. So if somebody wants to test that, go for it. Otherwise, I mean, it like it auto saves, so otherwise you're screwed. Uh, and we're just going to dart across this real quick. Whoop! Oh, I wasn't turned the right way. Okay. Get them, please. Uh, if you don't run across that bridge and take them on on the other side, you're just going to get peppered with those explosives and just die. So, Lots of traps in this game. Lots of traps. And we are in the Nini Works now. Drop down here. So you 
believe there's this item and there's one up above that we'll grab real quick. Chain, never use them. Dim ergo fragment, and we're actually gonna do this real quick. It's a trap. Like I said there's a lot of traps in this game, uh, but we're gonna do this one. So these things hit like a truck. They're slow, so you can easily run by. See, golly, I was gonna say you can easily run behind them and get a backstab, take them out. We just got the salamander dagger blade. New weapon. I'm not gonna use it, but it's there if you want it. Electric Blitz is effective for subduing puppets. Get out if you're not a stalker. There's a little tidbit there. Okay. i go back to the hotel, probably level up two more times, and then we'll call it a day. Made a good amount of progress. Not as much as we have in the past, I don't feel like, but... It's a good stopping point. We're in the next area. Next big area. Quite a lot to do there. A lot to see. Oh, oh, is this enough? To level up twice? Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just want to level up. Okay. So I do need about a thousand one hundred more. I'll do it. And now we're sitting pretty with 23 motivity. So we are hitting hard. Don't think I have enough still. Alright, so we'll end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.